Homeward Bound Daily Devotional by Alan G. White September, The Family of God The Beginning of the Home September 1st And the Lord God took man and put him into the Garden of Eden to dress it and keep it. Genesis chapter 2 verse 15 The Eden home of our first parents was prepared for them by God himself. When he had finished it with everything that they could desire, he said, let us make man in our image after our likeness. The Lord was pleased with these last and noblest of his creatures, and designed that they should be the perfect inhabitants of a perfect world. But it was not his purpose that any should live in solitude. He said, It is not good that man should live alone. I will make him and help me for him. God himself gave Adam a companion he provided and help me for him, a helper corresponding to him, one who was fitted to be his companion and who could be one with him in love and sympathy. Eve was created from a rib taken from the side of Adam, signifying that she was not to control him as the head, nor to be trampled under feet as inferior, but to stand by his side as an equal, to be loved and protected by him. A part of man, bone of his bone, and flesh of his flesh, she was his second self, showing the close union and the affectionate attachment that should exist in this relation. For no man ever hated his own flesh, but nourisheth and cherisheth it. Therefore shall a man leave his father and his mother, and shall cleave unto his wife, and they shall be one. Father and mother who make God first in their household, who teach their children that the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, glorify God before angels and before mankind by presenting to the world a well-ordered, well-disciplined family, a family that love and obey God instead of rebelling against Him. Christ is not a stranger in their home. His name is a household name, revered and glorified. Angels delight in a house where God reigns supreme and the children are, children are taught to reference religion, the Bible and their creator. Such families can claim the promise, them that honour me I will honour. As from such a home the father goes forth to his daily duties, it is with a spirit softened and subdued by converse with God. This was your daily devotional. Thank you for listening. Hope you can join us tomorrow. Homeward Bound